What's up YouTube, today I'm going to teach you about Ivy League fashion, also known as preppy fashion. And I know a lot of you guys are always wondering what my certifications are for making these videos, and usually I don't have any, but this style is one of the top three most worn styles at my school, so I think I know what I'm doing. Also, before we get into this video, I had recently encountered some bad news. My goldfish was just diagnosed with Ligma, so if you could smash that like button, it could really help me and my goldfish out. Thanks, guys. So anyways, let's start with the shoes. A very common shoe is the Sperry, or any boat shoe will do. You're going to want to wear these without any socks, or at least an invisible sock. Your other shoe option is also the leathered loafer or derby shoe. You can wear these with no socks, or you can grab a pair of long socks. Now with the pants, you're going to want a white pair of chinos or a white pair of shorts. Either way will do the trick. Now your boat shoes are going to want to go really well with your shorts, and your loafers and derbies are going to go best with your pants. Now we got the shoes and the pants out of the way, let's get on to the tops. With your tops you have a couple of different options. Option number one is a blazer with a button down, commonly worn to fancy dinner parties. Now with your blazer you might not think you have a lot of options, but you really do. You have your solid colors along with any kind of pattern. I found that plaid blazers are a really common blazer for this aesthetic. Option number two is a collared shirt. This is usually the go-to look. It's very simple and easy to pull off. Pair these with a pair of your chino shorts and sperries and it's the perfect look for a day out on the family yacht. The final look is a more laid back look, which is the knitted sweater look. Now the sweater can go good with pants or shirts which makes it very versatile. You can put the sweater over a collared button down shirt or wear it over your shoulders. So those were the just three of the most common looks but there are a bunch more to explore. Finally getting into the brands, your go to brand is going to be Polo which is the biggest prep brand out there in my opinion but you got a bunch of other options like Vineyard Vines, Tommy Hilfiger and Lacoste. Anyways that's gonna wrap up this video make sure to hit that like button to stop Ligma and subscribe while you're at it and always I hope that you guys learned something and I hope to see you next time.